Let us get to the co-main yeah. event. Man. And if I had more muscle mass in my breast region, I would get Charles Oliveira's face tattooed <laughs> on my chest the way he has his relatives tattooed on his chest. I want to start with Ken Flo on this and then get to Raymond. Uh, Kenny, Charles Oliveira, man, you know, what else, what else can you say, man? He stopped 20 fucking men inside that octagon. <laughs> that's insane. Um, and especially when you when you have the backdrop and the context that that's in the 155 pound division, a division where you know the guys legitimately in the top 25, maybe top 30, are absolute killers. Now, I, I'll get into th- something a little bit different that might be a little bit of a party pooper, but um, I, as far as offensive skills and what this kid is capable of. When he hurts you, he takes you out right after that. That is a skill that very few people have, uh, and he can do it in a variety of ways, whether it's with some crazy, beautiful submission or some nasty knockout. Knees, elbows, uh, fists, it doesn't matter. He's an offensive marvel, and um, it's so pretty to see him work. When he's moving forward and he's in a groove, dude, there's very few people that are able to stop that. And uh, this was a performance that was much needed for him. He obviously wants that shot against Mahashev again. I think he deserves it. Uh, and I thought it was just a fantastic performance. He was in some trouble there for a little bit against Benil Daryush. Dar-